is the current crisis impacting your day-to-day -day retail banking business? What are the opportunities going forward? Well, I think that uh, the global crisis had uh, a big impact on our country, uh, especially in terms of um, transfer of funds and investment. We are a lot um, impacted by the, the regional crisis, uh, especially in uh, Syria. So it is a big challenge uh, for us and uh, a lot of opportunities. Uh, to know how to, to have this uh, equilibrium uh, between this uh, global crisis and the regional uh, crisis. How do you see retail banking activities evolving over the next couple of years? A lot of um, mobile banking opportunities um, impacting our day-to-day -day activities in terms of uh, retail but uh, without forgetting the face-to-face -face, uh, relationship that we have uh, with our customers especially with the, with the old generation uh, customers. How are you addressing changing customer needs in terms of marketing and distribution? What role does mobility play here? We play a lot on uh, client segmentation. Um, like, for example, if we take the, the online uh, side, uh, we, we talk a lot with the new generation. We try to play the modern banking uh, using new tools, for example, the e-channels, uh, uh, the social media and in parallel how we, we need to stick to, to the, the traditional banking ways to answer our uh, traditional old generation. With a longer term view, how do you foresee the role of face-to-face -face relationships versus remote interactions? Well, I think uh, the face-to-face -face relationship uh, will, will stay and uh, this comes uh, along with the, the client segmentation. Um, that it will stay because we have a lot of, uh, of clients that uh, prefer the physical uh, contact with the, the relationship manager. And uh, we also have this new type of client which, uh, who, who doesn't have uh, the time or prefer to have the, the mobile uh, banking and online uh, services. Mm -hmm.